guys, this is Anthony Tejada, your local Orlando realtor, and today we are in the heart of Kissimmee here in Cypress Hammocks with Lancy Homes, and this is the town home, and that's called the Hamilton. Now, the Hamilton is a three bedroom, two and a half bathroom, two car garage home with 1918 square feet. HOA is 215 and there is no CDD. There are plenty of amenities in this community, including a family resort style pool, designer upgrades, um, pool, playground, multi-sports field, walking trails, and a picnic area. Now, let me just explain with this uh, typical townhouse floor plan, the lot fees are usually 5,000 plus any luxury option package that you may choose, which ranges between 10,000, 12,000, or 14,500. Um, again, now, if you choose to build out, they would give you 10,000 closing costs at time of video, and also the price of the home, 381,990, is at time of video. Now, it would be 391,999 to 405,999, depending on which luxury package you would choose. If you can, please press the subscribe and alert buttons down below. It truly does help my channel. But let's go take a look at this model. All right, guys, so here we are at the Hamilton. As you can see, you have your garage right here on the left side of the home with the two uh, coach lights. And the homes are connected, of course. As we pull in, we have a small foyer on the exterior side here for you with this solid door. And as the model has ceramic tiling upgrades, as you can tell, but as soon as you come into the home, you have a window here for natural light, and then it goes right into your kitchen area. Now, let me describe this kitchen for you. We have a split sink here with a extended neck on the gooseneck, but of course, stainless steel furnish, um, appliances like your microwave, your cooktop, and your stove, and also your dishwasher here. Lots of cabinetry on the bottom, 42 inch cabinets, do line this area. Now your fridge is usually right here, but you do have the overhang for it. Through this area here, you have the granite continuing on right here for your drop and stop, which your pantry pull out closet here and your door for your two car garage here. Passing through this area here, we have our stairs to go up, but I'll show you that in a minute. But we do have another storage closet right here. And again, we have the island that is parallel to your informal dining area right here, with your pendant lighting on top, another window for natural lighting. And it pulls the home into your gathering area here with your feature wall, of course. Now, I do love these windows. So you have the two slider windows on each side and then the big window pane in the middle, which brings in so much light into the home and into the gathering area for entertainment purposes. I love that. And then also you have your outdoor space here. And here is your covered lanai area. And you can see you can fit furniture here very comfortably but here's uh, an idea of your backyard space back here that's very nice your condenses here but it's fenced off very nice so let's enter back into the home coming back into the home you do have your powder room here And there's a notch out right here. And now let's head upstairs, guys, so I can show you what exactly comes with the upstairs of this home. All right, guys, so when you get upstairs uh, to the part, top part of this home, right here we have the stairs. Then we have a little notched out study area. I love that. That's very nice. Then we enter to the first room of the home, which looks like it's for the princess of the home. A very nice, spacious, um, space here window for natural lighting of course look at all the furniture that fits in this room but what's interesting is you have a walk-in closet here which pulls you in to a vanity area here and this is like a Jack and Jill setup so you got your pendant lighting your mirror cabinetry below it pulls into the commode and bathtub here 
And here is your linen closet. Also into the next vanity area right here. Again, with pendant lighting mirror cabinetry on the bottom. Love that. And then to the secondary bedroom of this Jack and Jill set, of course. And if you pull forward, you'll see a deep step-in closet here. Another window for natural lighting, but plenty of space for a townhome, very nice. And as we revolve back out to the trunk of the home, we have our domestic suite here where your washer and dryer would go. Here is your utility closet with your AC. And finally, into your primary bedroom suite where the first door on your right would be a linen closet. A walk-in closet here on the right, which then pulls you in to your primary bath suite, right? Where you have your dual vanity set, cabinetry, mirror, pendant lighting. You have a small mirror here. I mean, window, sorry, window here for natural lighting. But then you have your seamless glass shower with the Lestello and electronic controls here for your sprayer and rain head shower. Now on the left of this is also the commode for the primary. And then finally guys, if you follow me this way, here we are in the primary bedroom suite. Three windows line up the walls for natural lighting. This is a king size bed with a bench in front and you see how much space you still have. You know, you have the cadenza here and a desk on that side. Lots of furniture in this room and you still have so much space. I love that. But guys, this is your Hamilton floor plan. Stay tuned for a couple another words for you. So guys, if this home or this townhome interests you and your family, give me a call 407-790-0929. My name is Anthony Tejada, your local Orlando realtor, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you.